I am camping in the desert a few miles west of the town of Quartzsite, Arizona. It is my first desert camping experience. I arrived a week ago. Actually, for a few days, I didn't know if desert camping would grow on me or not. It has taken most of the first week, but it is indeed starting to grow on me. I am blown away by the number of desert campers there are all around here. I had heard that there were thousands, but now I believe there are tens of thousands. The RV parks everywhere are packed with RVs. Camping out in the desert on BLM land that surrounds Quartzsite for miles in every direction is free. BLM stands for Bureau of Land Management. This camping is known as dry camping or boondocking. There are no amenities of any kind, just a piece of the desert to camp on for free. The desert is full of all kinds of vehicles ranging from the huge two to three to four hundred thousand dollar motorhomes to camper vans like mine to all kinds of trucks and trailers that have been converted into some kind of camper by do-it-yourselfers. And there are hundreds simply pitching a tent or sleeping in their vehicles. I, as you might expect, am camping in Henry, my 2003 VW Eurovan camper. Never having been to Quartzside, and not knowing where to camp. Back in December, I started following a caravan group loosely organized by the nonprofit Home on Wheels Alliance. They pick a good campsite in the Arizona desert for a group to camp for 14 days, which is the maximum allowed by the Bureau of Land Management. At the end of the 14 days, they pick another good campsite for the group to move to in order to continue camping if so desired. Regulations stipulate that the next campsite must be at least 25 miles away from the previous campsite. The previous campsite for this caravan was Parker, Arizona. You can join a caravan for just a day or two or for a week or two or three or you can follow the caravan all summer long. A caravan is organized for just women, another for just men, and a couple for both women and men together. For me, being new, the caravan helped me enter the desert. So that is how I came to be camping where I am. Arriving in Quartzside from the north on State Highway 95, I followed the directions given. Get on Interstate 10 heading west. Get off at the Dome Rock exit, the second exit. Turn left on Dome Rock Road and proceed 2.7 miles looking for the white caravan sign on the right side of the road. Turn into the desert and look for the red flag showing the place for nightly gatherings around the campfire for those who want to visit with other caravanners. Most of the caravanners picked their campsite fairly near the red flag. I chose to camp at some distance away and by myself. I have grown to love my campsite. I chose it because there is no one camping close by. Also because there is a wash, a sandy area, just behind me, and I knew there would be no one else camping in my view to the north. Next week, a little more about my campsite and what I do during the day. <music>